Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this uh, little uh, episode, I'm going to be um, talking about my new N gauge layout I'm going to be making in a coffee table in the living room. Uh, it's we haven't decided I haven't decided on a name yet. All I know is it's going to be beside the seaside, and as you can see from this picture, it is the main layout of what I'm going to be using. Although of course there's a slight change of points and what have you. Um, so. These are the set, this is the track I've bought, uh, Pico Set Track Starter Set. Um, great little set, have plenty of um, track in there, it does the job that I need. Um, underneath the base of the track, I'm going to be using this Pico Streamline SL350 molded ballast underlay, uh, which you have to replace every 10 years, and um, yeah, that saves uh, getting gravel out and putting it all round. So, um, then in one of the Pico set track books, I'm uh, using this track at the bottom, but adapting it to be by the sea. But the uh, station and the factory are staying. I want to be incorporating a, a little fishing village and all sorts into it as well. And now the road running straight around the middle and should be looking quite nice. So, this is the train I've got going to be running on it. There will be more to follow, of course. It is the um, Graham Farish by Backman Seaside Excursion. Um, great little train. Uh, I've not actually tested it yet to see if it works because uh, I need to get the track down. At the moment, I'm taking it down because I need to put a uh, base underneath everything. But it should be quite good. I've seen a few pictures on Facebook groups on this train. It does look quite a good train. So these are the factory buildings that I've got. The factory um, chimney pot though we've put down because it's going to be in a, can't afford to go high because it's going to be in a coffee table. Everything's going to be quite low. So I've cut it off, although I think I've cut it off a bit too low. But it, it does the job, it'll do the job. A bit of smoke, a bit of cotton wool, blackened, coming out the top of that and it'll look quite nice. So as I said, that that is uh, basically what my engage layout is going to be. A nice little seaside town, uh, with a little docking port with some fishing boats, and you've got a beach and you have a, and everything. So yeah, I'll keep you posted on how that comes along. Uh, there's more of a progress through it. Uh, thank you very much for watching the channel. Do please do keep subscribing and liking the Facebook page. I'll see you next time with another video.